Hey guys, in today's video we'll be learning about indentation. So let's open up our main.cpp file and fix any indentation problems that we have. As you can see, our normal indentation consists of one tab. But as you can see below, we have some arrows on line 15 and 16, as well as 18 to 21. But there's many ways to fix this. Basic way of fixing it is you can actually go to the beginning of the line, you can press shift i to get to the very beginning, and you can press tab, or you can fix it by pressing shift and pressing the right caret twice. And that will shift over one tab. But let's say that we want to fix lines 18 to 21. To shift it back one tab space, you can get to visual mode by pressing shift b to select multiple lines of code, then select the lines through 21 by pressing j, and then hold shift and press the left arrow once. And that will bring everything back one tab space. But now let's make another example. Now let's say that the end brace is actually at the very beginning where C out is as well. And we want to shift both of these lines by one tap to the right. If you go to line 20, you press 2 to mark how many lines you want total, and press shift right arrow twice. And it'll move the first and the line underneath, which is selected as the second line, to be shifted together. This is a way to select multiple lines to be shifted without having to highlight them. But we still need to fix line 20. We can easily fix this by putting our cruiser on line 20 and pressing shift right caret key twice. And there you go. All our lines are now properly indented to our liking. Alright guys, that's a simple video on how to indent properly. I hope you take this and make some good use out of it. Thanks for watching.